Welcome to Time Beat Breaking News Channel. Here are our breaking news today. 1. Thousands of fans gather at Ibrox ahead of title celebrations at Rangers. 2. The Queen will pay a private visit to Balmoral to mourn Prince Philip. The United Kingdom. Thousands of fans gather at Ibrox ahead of title celebrations at Rangers. Thousands of Rangers supporters have descended on Ibrox, setting off blue and red flares in anticipation of the team winning the Scottish Premiership for the first time in a decade. Fans screamed and applauded as the players exited the team bus ahead of their 12.30 p.m. home game against Aberdeen. Hundreds of fans are expected to march into Glasgow's heart after the trophy is raised, with the Union Bears fan group announcing plans to walk from the stadium to George Square. Rangers' response after thousands of fans gathered outside Ibrox and in George Square on the weekend they clinched the title in early March was previously criticised by the Scottish Government. Hundreds of Rangers fans lit red flares along the Clyde near the Clyde Arc, also known as the Squinty Bridge, on Friday night. Under the existing restrictions, no one should be meeting in groups of more than six at the stadium or any other venue, and Police Scotland supports the club in encouraging its fans to do the right thing and obey the coronavirus legislation around gatherings, said Chief Superintendent Mark Sutherland, Divisional Commander for Greater Glasgow Division. The United Kingdom, the Queen will pay a private visit to Balmoral to mourn Prince Philip. According to reports, the Queen will fly to Balmoral this month to privately mourn Prince Philip following his death in April. Her Majesty will travel to the sprawling Scottish estate on a low-key out-of-season tour, which she normally makes with other members of the royal family from August to October. Following the death of her husband, Prince Albert, Queen Victoria embarked on a similar journey almost 160 years ago. The Queen will stay at the seven-bedroom Craigowen Lodge on the Balmoral Estate, which is only a short distance from where she and Prince Philip spent part of their honeymoon seven decades ago. There will be no trips to the Highland Games or visits from heads of state, according to the report. Prince Philip and the Queen spent their summer holidays away from Windsor Castle at Balmoral. If the Queen wishes to spend the summer at Balmoral, she will most likely be accompanied by other members of the royal family, including the Cambridges, the Wessexes, Prince Charles and Camilla, and the Duke and Duchess of Rothesay. In her first major public ceremonial appearance since the death of the Duke of Edinburgh, the Queen laid out the government's agenda this week. Thank you for watching. We help you stay up to date all the news hourly. Please subscribe our channel to follow up the latest one.